everybody, it is June 17th and it has been about four days, I believe, since I last went into the big hive. So today I'm not doing a full inspection. I just want to see more signs of eggs and the presence of a queen. So this hive here has been queenless for quite a while now. I believe it's swarmed at least once, probably more like twice. And so it doesn't have any brood in it. And the last time I checked, there was about half a frame of eggs in it, and the bees were starting to backfill up the brood chamber. Sorry, there's a plane going by. So a week prior to the last hive check I did, I spun out some frames to make sure there was room for the queen to lay. And then when I went back in there, the bees had been very busy. We've had a very strong spring flow, and they fill that space up with nectar. So I spun out six more frames to make sure she had enough room, otherwise she would want to swarm as well. So today I'm just looking for more signs of eggs to make sure that this hive is queen right, and yeah, hopefully it'll be a quick check. All right, let's get in there. Here's my smoker. I've already puffed the entrance so they know I'm coming. There's some activity here, which is always a good sign. Okay, so zoom out and uh, let's get in there. All right, I do see some new wax on the excluder. Okay, I do see some wax building. This is a good sign. I do see some new wax building. I put some empty foundation frames in there and I see some drawn comb, which is a good sign. That means there's activity and that potentially they are making more room for the queen to lay. Give them a little puff and say hello. And uh, see what we got here. This was a new frame last time, so let's see if there's any activity. Alright, this is nice. This is drawn. This is nectar on it. But this is all drawn. This is good. See how that's drawn out? That's what it looked like before, just foundation. And that is all newly drawn comb. Nothing in it yet. Just a little tiny bit of nectar. Okay, that's good though. It shows some initiative on the bees part, some activity. This is also drawn and filled with nectar. What I really want to see are some eggs though. So let's go deeper in here. I think I'm going to take this honey frame out. Yep, that's full of nectar. So let's shake this one off. I'm going to shake this one and drop it down below. Nothing in there. I see one cup, but no, no egg in there. up in the super and bring a foundation. Give them another blank here to make sure there's enough room for them to uh, draw out. Honeybound is when they create nectar or honey above themselves and the queen does not have room to lay any longer, which is not good. That's what we do not want. Okay, so Let's check down even deeper. This one, for all intents and purposes, is a nectar or honey super. And I believe it was in this box that I saw brood. I'm hoping to see signs of eggs or brood. 
So where I saw the eggs last time, they should have hatched and they may even be capped. This is a nectar frame. Don't expect to find the queen on this frame. This is all honey and nectar. So, this is drawn. This is nice. It's all drawn out. Do I see signs of eggs though? No. This is all honey. Boy. I have to move some of these honey frames out of here. Wow. They are just collecting mad nectar. This is all drawn. And this whole side is filled with nectar. Okay. I'm going to move this honey frame out of here too. Plenty of stores. This is just, uh, that uh, down there is not a queen cell. That is just um, burr cone. More nectar. So I spun this out last week and it's all fun filled with nectar again. Holy smokes. Okay, so I'll put that. Nectar, all nectar. I spun that all out. Oh my God. These girls are crazy. So much honey. Do a little bit of clean up here. So far, no signs of eggs. Not good. But at least they're drying out, which is encouraging. I'm gonna go get some empty frames here. And move this one out of the way next. Really hope there's some brood in here. If not, we're gonna have to get a new queen. But I have a queen in my nuke, so I might just have to move her over. Right oh good, you see that? We have brood and capped brood at that. Great. That means I have a queen. Yes! So this is the frame I saw last week that had eggs in it. Wonderful. And the eggs have hatched. Now, I want to see more signs of eggs though, but see this? There are some cups down below. So let's look at that. Let's see how these cups look. Make sure they're not swarming again. Now, these cups are empty. And that is not a queen cell. Right there, not. That's just some burr comb. So we're gonna remove that. Because you could potentially squish bees when you replace this frame. So I'm just gonna clean that off. But we have a new generation of bees, which is great. So now I wanna see more signs of a queen. Let's see if I can see any more eggs on this frame. So, take this out for a minute. So, I have one frame of brood, which is wonderful. Let's see what's on this frame. Oh yes, more capped brood. Wonderful, my queen is active. If I look carefully, I may actually be able to find her. And here's more here. Now, here are some Here's a queen cup, but it is empty. So, I have to keep an eye on these because this is the, still the tendency, they may have a tendency to want to swarm again. Even though they've swarmed on me, I think at least once, if not twice. Okay, so two frames of brood so far, it's good. Let's see what else is in here. 
Okay, this is getting dotted up with nectar. Not too keen on. Let's see if there's anything going on in here. Let's see some more cups. Alrighty, I found another frame of eggs. Great. And it was a very good laying pattern, which is great. So I have a clean, but I did see a couple cups on the bottom. Just gotta make sure I keep checking in on these ladies because I don't want them to swarm again. This is a nectar. Okay, let's see. Let's see if there's anything on the. Okay. Nectar, nectar, nectar. Oh, nectar. All right, again, I'm gonna move some of these nectar frames up and put some foundation in here because this is a lot of honey down here. Make sure they have enough room to lay. So, I've seen evidence of the queen, and now I'm just gonna button this up. I don't need to disturb it anymore. I know that there's brood in here, and that there's a queen. Um, so, I'm just gonna turn this off. Alrighty, so that is great news. The hive is queen right. So indeed, that little smattering of eggs that I saw last week, or the few days ago, my last hive check, they were eggs, they have now pupated, and they are now capped brood. I saw a two frames of eggs, and then two other frames of capped and hatched brood. So this is great. This is the first new brood this hive has seen in weeks. And so although I didn't see the queen, um, she has been there recently. <laughs> so I did see some queen cups. They're completely empty. I'll have to keep an eye on this thing. Um, come in here another few days and make sure there are no other swarm cells. But yes, this hive is finally back in order. <laughs> so let's go check out the other two hives here and I'll give you little updates about these ones. So uh, this is my nuke. So here's a little update about this one. This is my nuke and I've opened it up for one hive body and this second hive body just contains a feeder. So I'm feeding them syrup so they can expand and draw comb and there is my Reba Grant hive. So let's take a peek in both of those. So here is my nuke. I have a lot of honey in my main hive and I'm just going to give this one a frame of honey for resources, although there is a feeder in here as well. So I just added this feeder on here yesterday and they've had, they haven't drank that much. They probably drank maybe a cup or so since yesterday, but this encourages them to draw comb. They need carbohydrates to draw comb. And comb of course gives the queen some foam here. I'm a little sure on the equipment. This is a very small hive. Um, so I'm going to give them a little bit of honey. Although they have some see how she's doing in terms of laying. I just added the syrup feeder yesterday, so it hasn't given them too much opportunity to build out. But let's see if we can spot the queen. Oh yes, great. So this they've drawn out. They've drawn that out and that is all filled with eggs. Great. So very small little hive here. Let's see if we can spot the queen. This is not a marked queen, so she's a little bit harder to see. Is a lot harder to see. Okay, capped brood, great. And recently hatched brood. And eggs and all frames. Let me go see in the sun if I can spot the eggs in this frame. Hi, Jokes! There's the queen. 
There she is, right there. See the queen? She's right there. Okay, let's put them back. Oh good, I see recently hatched brood. Perfect. Alright, these guys are on their way. These girls are on their way. Let's button them back up. So that's June 20th, 2018. Saw two of my queens and signs of my other queens. So, three queen right hives. Yay! <laughs> see you next time, bye! Mm -hmm.